Всем привет! Hello everyone! Я Ари. Welcome back to my channel Every Russian. Today I've got a pronunciation video for you. In this video I collected some vocabulary that in my opinion is usually difficult for beginners. I chose some of words that learners of Russian language have somewhat troubles with. So today, while watching this video, try to speak out these words and check yourself. I will pronounce each word slowly and repeat. Please try to copy my pronunciation. And before we get started, I'd like to remind you to subscribe to my channel and press the notification button so that you will know when to see my next video. Okay? Are you ready? Let's begin! The first word from the list is very important for beginners. This is the word здравствуйте and it means hello. You especially need to pronounce this word correctly because you will always use it to start a conversation. What kind of difficulties here might be? First, remember that letter V in the middle of this word is silent. So we pronounce the word like this Здравствуйте and not Здравствуйте I think it's even not so comfortable to speak it out this way. Also, the beginning of the word ZDR often makes people confused because all three letters here are consonants and all of them are pronounced. Maybe it's not so easy to pronounce these three letters one by one, but try not to put any other sounds between them. There are no any extra sounds between them, so it shouldn't be ZDARA or ЗАДАРА. Instead of this, say ЗДРА. ЗДРАСТВУЙТЕ. ЗДРАСТВУЙТЕ. Now please look at the second word. The meaning of this word is happiness. How would you pronounce it? С ЧАСТЬЕ or ЩАСТЬЕ. If you watched my previous vocabulary videos, you might notice how I pronounce this word there. I will put the link to this video in the description box so you can see this word in the example sentences and also some other useful words. So, the correct variant is the second one. ЩАСТЬЕ It's a little bit difficult to say it like с ЧАСТЬЕ and move the tan from a position for a sound s to ch. Much better and easier pronounce it when the tan slide with sh sound. Shastie. And one more thing about this word is that in the end you should say tie, not tie. Shastie. Shastie. One more word that I have here for you is пожалуйста. This is also one of frequently used words and it means please. What did you notice when I pronounced it? Listen carefully. Пожалуйста. Y is silent here. We do not pronounce it. So remember that and don't say пожалуйста. Also in this word the letter O in the beginning sounds as A. Пожалуйста. Пожалуйста. Number four, and here I have this word. It means mouse. How to pronounce this? Try to speak it out. Mish, mish, or mish. The correct answer is mish. Please repeat after me. Mish. The sound U is often causes some trouble, especially here when it stands nearby the sound SH. Let's try to say it. Ush. Ush. Right. Do you hear that sh sounds hard? Notice that no matter there is a soft sign after it, sound sh is always hard. So it doesn't sound mish. It's mush. Mush. Let's look at the next word. It means Tuesday. And now please think, is it вторник or вторник? The correct pronunciation is вторник. Вторник. В in this word 
we should pronounce as f. F sounds much better and easier to spell, isn't it? Please repeat after me. Vtornik. Vtornik. Number six. Mushina. The translation of this word is a man, and this word is a little bit difficult to pronounce for beginners. Notice that here we pronounce the sounds zh and sh as one long sound sh. Okay, now follow me and try to imitate my pronunciation. Mushina. Mushina. The next word, number seven is very short, but sometimes it can cause some troubles with pronunciation. The meaning of this word is five. How would you pronounce it? Is it piat, 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 or piat? Of course, the right way is to say piat, piat. Here the letter p has a soft sound p. And the letter T is soft too. Notice that there is no Y sound in the middle of the word, so it shouldn't be Piat. Remember and repeat the correct pronunciation. Piat. Piat. The next word is also might be difficult sometimes. This word means a watch. And how should we pronounce it? Cha si or Chi si. Okay, I can tell you now that R in this word turns into E. And again, I think getting much easier to pronounce in this way. Let's practice to speak it out. Chisu. Chisu. Let's look at this word, number nine. This is an adjective and it's used pretty often in conversations. It means good. And let's think about the pronunciation of this word. Is it Horoshi or Haroshi. First letter O here is pronounced as A. Also notice how the sound Y is pronounced in the end of this word with less power. So it sounds not like Haroshi Y, but Haroshi. Haroshi. And here is the last word, but it's one of the very difficult words. If you remember in the beginning of this video, in the word Здравствуйте, there were three consonants standing together and it was not so easy to pronounce them. And here we have four consonants standing one by one in this word. V, S, T, R. I think it will be better for you to pronounce them if you know that the first letter V here should be pronounced as F. Встреча. Встреча. So that's it for today's video. Today we talked about how to pronounce 10 Russian words that usually cause some troubles for learners. If you have any questions, you can leave me a message below. If you like this video, you can subscribe to my channel and press the notification button so that you will know when to see my next videos. See you in my next video. Пока-пока!